It's the time I know there's a lot of big, important outdoor events going on today. There will be a decent rain break. I am seeing more scattered storms by the end of the day, some potentially strong to severe, but these will be spotty in nature. It is going to stay warm and humid. And yes, it's going to feel like summer this weekend with more sunshine on the way. Right now, our heaviest rain over the last 24 hours really added up in southwest Iowa. We had around a quarter of an inch earlier this morning around Des Moines. All this rain is lifting to the north, and I want to stress, this is just a steady rainfall right around Highway 20 and in western Iowa. At least that's where we're seeing the heaviest right now. A break in Des Moines, it's dry for the most part in the city of Des Moines. This is where we're seeing that rain right along Highway 20, a little more right around Carroll this morning. We'll continue to see scattered showers lift off to the east northeast. But again, it's not going to rain all day much like yesterday. If you do see sunshine, our instability will go up and there will be a greater potential for large hail and even some stronger winds and yes, even some isolated weak tornadoes. So we'll be watching these storms closely. The key time will be closer to 6 p.m. This is where the storm focus will be tomorrow. Today, it will continue to be wet at least for the next couple of hours. I do think after 10 a.m. and really before 5 p.m., things will quiet down around Des Moines, but start to kick up along that southern border. And that's where we'll see our strongest storms fire up closer to 6 p.m. And more waves of rain will continue up through 10 o'clock tonight and again early tomorrow morning. But by the end of the day on Friday, we'll start to see some sunshine and it does look drier Friday night and it will start off sunny on Saturday. And that's when you'll hear everybody out mowing their lawn. On Sunday, it also looks warm and sticky. Today's additional rainfall will be around a quarter of an inch, some isolated higher mounts once again in southwest Iowa. There will be a band of around another half inch to an inch by the end of the week where you see that light blue. But again, that could shift as the storm system moves in. But overall, it doesn't look like northwest Iowa will see as much as the rest of the state, which is not necessarily a good thing. On Saturday afternoon, there's a chance of a stray storm as it gets warmer. A similar setup exists on Sunday, but the overall chances are fairly low at this point. We're starting off in the 60s across the state, much like yesterday, and it's sticky. The dew points up there too. It will be noticeable throughout the day today that added humidity and the winds will be out of the southeast at around 11 this morning and stay out of the southeast throughout the day. 78 for the high. That's where we got yesterday. We'll experience weather similar to what we experienced on Wednesday. A mix of clouds, some sunshine, and then some scattered storms. The only difference is the potential for stronger storms exists later on in the day, and that could add up to a little more rainfall. 66 for the low tonight and tomorrow afternoon does look drier and warmer with a high of 82. Most of your weekend looks dry, highs in the 80s. Monday into Tuesday, we will see a better chance for more pop-up storms, and then on Wednesday, 77 and it looks mainly dry on Wednesday today because the weather looks almost identical to yesterday. It gets another three.